Well, hello there and welcome here to my channel. I am here doing a video today. Um, as you can see, I had mentioned that I bought all my, I have bought all my plants in. Well, not all of them, but most of them. Um, some of them will stay outside over winter, but we are beating, we are being greeted by my um, Thanksgiving cactus plants. I got two of them, two different colors, and they're both doing really, really super well. This one is really taking off blooming. Well, they both are. So especially since I bought them inside now, they're really, they're really blooming. Um, our weather just gotten too cold. I mean, like today it's going to be 65, but then it's going to go back down. But I don't want to confuse the plants. So I just, I'm at the point, because I usually just bring them in, take them out, bring them in, take them out back in the day, but not anymore. Once I bring them in, they're in until, until late spring or something. But yeah, those are my Thanksgiving cactus plants. Um, there are a bunch of different kind of cactus. And the main thing, the main reason I tell if they're Thanksgiving or Christmas is when they bloom. And they do it, and they do kind of all got a different look to them. But mine are pretty Thanksgiving because they bloom every year around about this time. So these are definitely Thanksgiving cactus plants. Then we got my cats right there, both of them. Charlotte, <laughs> you gotta look at the camera. <laughs> what about you, Rocky? You like being in the camera. Every time I do a video on my other channel, you like being in the camera. <laughs> yeah, they're just chilling. You know, cats, they sleep 16 hours a day. They're only up for like eight hours, so. Yeah, and I just realized they usually up around dawn and dusk, so. That makes sense, though. So, yeah, those are my cats. We're going to move on. Got my bamboo plant right there. I think that happened when it was out. Ooh, I think I need to give it I need to give it a little bit of sun. I keep forgetting to put it with the other stuff during the day. But, yeah, I'm going to have to give it some sun, probably, because it ain't got no light. So, yeah. Then, obviously, I got plants in my goldfish tank. Get to see some fish too. Mainly pothos in there and some aquatic. And obviously, those are my fish. Down here, we got a bunch of plants at tank in my crab tanks. And all those are plants that I cut it off my plants to put in here. Is there any crabs around? No, they all seem to be hiding. So. Oh, wait a minute. There's one right there. Can you see that? There was a vampire crab right there. Super soaked. Then I also put some of my African cloud frogs tanks. Some plants. Then right here we got my lily plant. I forget the name of this plant, but it's in there with the... I got a lot of this plant in there with the fish tanks because this I kind of find out this plant loves water. Then I got all these up here. I got my pothos plant. I got this plant. I'm trying to see if it's going to come back or not. I don't know, but. And yeah, my pepper plants are right there. The one pepper plant that I grew on this one, I ate it. It was pretty good. I mean, it was really small, but it was pretty good. I mean, it wasn't hot or nothing. I wasn't even sure if that was a bell pepper or some kind of jalapeno or cilantro, but it was one, so I took it. Dragon fruit right there. Cactus. Ooh, where are these nuts? i do something about that. Dusty Miller right there. My other potos. Then I got this cool plant I found outside. And then I'm pretty sure my um, sensitive plant ain't going to do too well. Because even when I touch it, now it's not. Yeah, so that one's, this one is done. I'm just going to take that one down. Then I got this plant right there. That'll probably bloom for me around Christmas or late later winter. But it's doing really good growing. And then I got this plant I bought in. 
Then the spider plant is down at the bottom. And then I got the I love plant right there. This is where I'm going to end the video. Um, I still got some plants outside, so I'll probably be showing you those in a couple of days. I mean, it's mainly just like kale and, you know, kale, Swiss chard and stuff like that to show you to show you guys how they're doing and how they're still growing. Because they're cool water. I mean, cool water. They're, they're cool tolerant, so, yeah. But anyways, if y'all like these type of videos, I'd love to have you come join me here on my channel. If you want to see more videos of me, please hit the notification bell and that can happen. Until the next video I make, stay safe, stay blessed, goodbye.